hey guys what's up this is you guys with a new tutorial on excel so guys in this tutorial i will show you the most important feature in excel formulas how to use formulas in excel and how to make your project very simple and make your uh, make your files and very easy to calculate or anything you want so why first of all what these formulas the formulas in excel is widely used for some average or anything we look up actually look up or any other um, any other you can see any other function if you want to use in mathematics to go back to any date and time formats and any look and reference so guys please 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 this video is very important i will make many parts of this video i will show you all the main main uh, excel formula which is used widely in all in all offices and anything and any other organization so guys first of all let's let's start with the formula tab you can see there's a formula tab of auto sum recently used functions financial function logical text date and time look and reference mathematics and more functions so guys first of all we do not use this tab because we have to remember the formulas in your tips so guys i will simply um i will tell you about the sum formula first of all guys very important tip use when we you use formula use from equal to sign the equal to sign is used to assign the formula if i want to use a plus like sum so i think i when i say equal to it from this sum and these are for you can see this is a symbol of functions this is a symbol of function that we use the functions but if i don't use equal to i really sum this is it's going to be a text okay guys it's going to be a text simple text the excel has does not equal that that is a we use one to formula so we have to we have to start with equal to sign and type sum after click sum you have to press tab tab is used not by not using your mouse simply click tab and number one you can see the excel says that we have to find the number one so guys when we go number one and then comma guys and number two comma guys you can uh, you can um plus any number or any any type one two hundred or anything i i will also choose one extra and three after the using a formula you have to close this bracket so simply close this bracket and click enter you can see the sum is there and you can see the formula is sum b3 c3 and d3 b3 c3 and d3 b uh you can see that b3 c3 and d3 formulas okay so you, if you want to check this so simply go there and select three of that and you can see the sum there one eight eight two three so we have found the one eight eight two three eight so guys this is a this is only a sum formula then we use uh, many formulas like that uh, if you want to use uh, if you want to give a date okay guys that year 2017 month 04 and uh, day 01 so guys, this is going to be like date 4 1 2017 this is going to be date uh, you can simply change the format i will show you in a bit because you do you can simply go there go home click on that sign and if you want to choose custom if you want to choose ddmmyy mddyy monthly data yeah, or you can simply choose you you can simply go there dd mm -Y -Y or anything you want simply select okay guys this is a very simple function since excel uh, second um and other common function is average you can simply choose average number one you can simply or you can simply by comma you can simply click shift and and select three of that click that and simply you can find the average so if you want to check this average you can simply go there and you can find it four seven three zero six seven seven you can see that guys okay this is a very very common formulas used in excel or you can simply use uh, the second formula is true or false that i write one 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 two two five six five six any, any other value guys as i like that anything you want to return click nine then uh, take second order one one five four eight six six five four five six okay guys so i want to check that this and these are equal so i simply click equal to that number and equal to that number so you can say this is true when you want to use formula the all set simply shift and down arrow and click ctrl d ctrl d for is for track you can see that the, the formula in one cell has been assigned to all other cells so you can true one one true 
one and five false and this is false this is a conditional uh, conditional formula guys it is very useful for checking your results or any presentation if you want to check with your other, uh, uh, other files you can simply use this formula for making this is very for making your uh, confirmation successful okay guys uh, next one uh, next one is the formula is lookup reference lookup reference i will show you lookup reference in, in, in my other videos because uh, guys i will make some other video i will give you the topics when i have covered that we look up we look up values uh, pivot tables what pivot tables i will show you in my in my next uh, upcoming videos logical functions functions and uh, pivot table h lookup h lookup is no values but i will uh, i will tell you what is h lookup and many the formula so guys this is the, in my next video but we have to learn other more feeling like called Danny gate if i write uh, my name lukesh and core so i want this in my uh, in my single column so i i do not have to make single copy i have to use equal to Content gate. You can see the content gate. Click tab, text one, text two, and click close. And you can find the UK score. But guys, I want the space in my name. I want the space in my name. So simply, simply, guys, I will choose. Um, I will click the. If you want to see the formula, you can simply go there or simply type function F2. Which will give you a formula. Then I will choose this. I want the space for that. Click space guys and this will come with a space so you can see that by simply um simply inserting a two inverted commas we can find the space in my name that you wish or this is a very simple company net formula you can use in any any US special for uh, making last name uh, first name last name uh, equal and make your make your result perfectly uh, third one is guys there are uh, many other features like uh, uh, next one is counting how to make counting of numbers if I made one, two, if you it, there are two methods. First, first method is guys, first method is click one, click equal to um, two plus and this cell. Sorry, one is equal to one plus that cell. Two, and you can simply uh, simply drag it to shift. shift, 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 shift. I will like that and control D, and you can find that and number and come. And third one method is. If you want to use click one to select these these two click control and simply control then simply control and drag from there and you can simply control and mouse uh, left mouse and you can find all the numbers and so that there are two methods how to insert a number in Excel simply if you want to insert that there on uh, shortcut you can simply click shift and Control and uh, um, convert the semicolon and semicolon uh, uh, semicolon uh, uh, semicolon button in your keyboard and you can simply uh, you can simply uh, type today's date in simple manner simply control that okay there's a many important tips with the use in interviews so guys this is a very uh, very few of the uh, functions which is used widely you can try all the functions in um, from that and if you if you need any any help so you can simply comment on that uh, comment on the comment box like uh, add a down and you can simply join on facebook twitter you can also ask me a question from that so guys thanks for watching please write comment subscribe if you had any views on this video so guys please tell me i will make my video better for you and if you want extra videos on that i will also make that so guys, thanks for watching please write comment subscribe guys please subscribe for my new videos and i will upload many videos every week so guys every day i also every day so guys thanks for watching and have a nice day